Good morning. It is Friday, April 22nd. Um, if you're new here, my name is Katie and I'm going to film a little day in the life. Um, it's Friday, so it's a little bit more of like a fun day than what I usually have planned. I do have to work today. I have a nine to five and then I also do social media and content on the side. So there's going to be like a mix of that. And yeah, pretty like regular day around here. Nothing too crazy. But I did just want to take you along through my day and like kind of get a little behind the scenes into my life. So right now I just have my coffee and like usually for about an hour in the morning I'll sit on the couch. Actually like two hours from like six to eight. And I'll start working on my social media stuff and like check my analytics, check my socials, respond to comments, DMs, all that stuff, emails, and just make sure that I'm like set up for the day and have my content planned. So now I'm just getting ready to go work out. Um, honestly, I'm not even going to lie to you. I have not been in my workout game. Like, I'm not going to pretend like this is my normal routine. It's not. I would love for it to be my normal routine. But honestly, I have just been really inconsistent lately. And it's been um, causing me to feel groggy and honestly, like, not very confident. Um, it, when I work out, even if my body is not changing at all, I just feel so much more confident. So... I'm going to start the day with a workout so I can have a good day and I'll feel confident and productive. Yeah. I'm going to get ready to go. Outfit of the day to work out. This is just set active. I have this in two colors because I just think it's like the cutest little set. Um, it's not the best for like a high intensity workout day. It doesn't stay up super well. Um, but if I'm just like lifting weights or doing Pilates or something, then I think it works really well and I think it's just like so cute. Fun fact, we live in an apartment but we actually rented out a garage so that we could have our own little garage gym in here. So we have like pretty much everything that we need. We've got like the rubber flooring, the little turf, we've got a ton of equipment. So yeah, plenty for a good workout. This is what I'm gonna do today. I got this off of Sydney Adams if you follow her on TikTok. Um, she posts workouts on Instagram sometimes so usually I just go find something that she did so I'm gonna get this done and it's gonna be painful. I just got back from working out and Max made the cutest little breakfast. He's not working today, so he made us some breakfast. Pineapples, waffles, eggs, bacon. Just ate breakfast and took a little shower. Now I'm uh, just gonna get ready for the day. I don't really have like big plans. I'm honestly just gonna work like my nine to five and then I gotta go to the grocery store. Gonna get my nails done because I broke a nail working out. I don't know if it's gonna focus. Anyway, so I just did like a pretty natural makeup look. Um, one of my hacks that I can't stop sharing on all over the internet, honestly, is I can't find it, but it's using your eyebrow pencil to outline your lips and overlining on the top and the bottom and then filling in the middle with like a color that's very similar to your blush. And like, I am obsessed with it. I just think it creates like such a cohesive look. It's my new favorite, I wear it every single day like I literally even if I have like no makeup on I still pretty much put it on my lips so anyway I'm just gonna do a really casual like athletic-y outfit today I actually think I'm gonna wear my new Abercrombie traveler dress which I'll show you in a minute it is oh, it is so cute it is so cute so I think that outfit calls for like a really slick bun but I don't want to like slick back my hair because it's not that dirty and if I slick it back, I'm going to have to wash it tomorrow and I just probably am not going to want to do that either. So I'm just going to do like a kind of slick bun, like semi-slick. That was cute. Okay, that is the look for today. I'm honestly not even gonna hairspray it because I just don't want my hair to feel disgusting tomorrow. Outfit of the day is this cute little Abercrombie and Fitch Traveler dress. It's got like the built-in shorts, it's one shoulder. 
I think it's like the cutest, most comfy little dress and I'm obsessed. I'll link it below. All right, I'm going to get my nails done. I broke one this morning when I was working out. So I'm, I needed them done anyway. I haven't had them done since March 3rd. Look how grown out they are. But that's honestly why I always get like the clear on the bottom and the color on the top because then you can't really tell and you can go a really long time without getting them done. Like literally last week I was still getting compliments at the drive-thru of like my nails. So I'm just going to keep doing it. I did not do any research on what I wanted to get done. So I'm probably just going to stress choose something and like do the same thing with like just a tip. Maybe I'll do like white. That feels kind of beachy. I'll probably have the same nails when I go to the beach. So yeah, I think I'll do that. Um, I am nervous and I am make just because I hate getting my nails done and I hate sitting there the whole time. And I think I'm gonna have to get these ones taken off and get a whole new full set, um, which I just really don't enjoy. Okay, I got my nails done and I think they look really cute. I went with like a little pink that's like kind of neutrally, but also spring. Um, because I hate color like I almost got like a like a neon pink color And I just couldn't do it. I just couldn't do it. So yeah, I really like them. I think they're cute It did take literally forever, but that's life um, So now I'm just at the grocery store. I'm gonna run in and grab some food for dinner I think we're gonna make tacos and we have literally no food in our whole house So I'm gonna go to the grocery store and then head back home What's up? I came home to a couple PR packages, so I figured I would do a little unboxing just to see what it is. I actually don't know what this one is, um, so we'll, we'll see. Oh, True Volcanicals. So cute. All right, inside it is the, the Ginger Turmeric Cleansing Balm. Ooh, that, wait, that sounds so good. The Pure Radiance Oil and the Chabula Active Serum. I don't know what that means, but so cute. I actually have not tried this brand yet, but I'm really excited to try these things because honestly, I'm like not thrilled with my skincare routine at the moment. It's not that it's bad. It's very simple and I've just had the same routine for a year probably. And I, it's not that my skin's bad, I just feel like it could be a little bit better. And then the other one is from um, Azure Activewear. So I had this viral video. If you're here, it's probably because you saw my viral video and you followed me on TikTok. But um, it is... But it's the video where I'm wearing the white button down and the white zip up. And I had on an Azure Activewear set in that video and literally everyone was like obsessed with the set. So. They sent me another one. It's their new color. I forgot what the name of it is. So, hold on. Cute. Okay, it's the new color in stone. So I have like a really light grayish tone color. And this is like this be really beautiful like grayish blue. Let's see if the color picks up on camera. That's pretty, it, it actually looks a little bit more blue on camera. It's not blue. Definitely not blue. Um, but wow, so cute. This looks like a Lulu Racerback Y bra. And it honestly feels like it too. And then the leggings. Also, so beautiful. This color. I really like that they don't have a seam in the front. That's why I like their leggings. Because the, there's no front seam. But there's a butt seam, so you don't get the unibutt, you get like a nice shape without getting the front seam, if you know what I mean. Very cute. I like these. Aw, I'm gonna wear these tomorrow for my workout. All right, we're just gonna chill for a little while. Um, I got, now we're just gonna chill for a little while. I basically have done everything that I have to do today. Um, I might film like a couple TikToks. Actually, I did not do nearly enough for my 9 to 5 today. I actually should probably like log on and do a little bit more. Make sure I've done all my emails, all that. I've got a couple of brand emails to do, to respond to. Um, and then, yeah, then we're going to cook dinner. We're actually having taco night. My sister's going to come over and we're going to have tacos and cinnamon rolls and just like hang out. It's so beautiful outside. It like kind of hurts to even be indoors right now, but... That's what we're up to. 
it's 10 o'clock. I did forget to pick up my camera all night. Um, but we just had tacos for dinner. My sister came over and then we made some cinnamon rolls for dessert. And honestly, we just sat on the couch and like chatted and talked about TikTok, watched TikTok pretty much all night. Um, so now I'm just gonna be ready for bed. And I think I'm gonna try out these new skincare products that I got today from True Botanicals. I have never heard of this brand um, before literally they reached out to me. It's the ones that I showed you earlier, the little haul that I did. But I think I'm gonna test them out and see how they are. I'm really excited about this one. It's the Ginger Turmeric Cleansing Balm. Look how cute this packaging is. This is like the kind of stuff that you can leave on your counter and not have to like store it away because it's ugly. So it says, warm a quarter size amount between fingers and massage over dry skin and around eye area to dissolve all makeup and then you rinse. And it came with this cute little scooper. Okay, how much quarter size amount? Okay. I think that's way more than a quarter. Okay, I'm warming it up with my fingers. Ooh, I got way too much. Okay, and the massage. Oh, it's so smooth. Wait, this is actually so smooth. Wow. Okay, review yeah it's like fantastic on my skin but it does not take my eye makeup off so i still had to like wash my eyes so good morning it's the next day um my camera did die right in the middle of trying to show you that new skincare um i'll give like a full review on it after i've used it for Maybe like a month. That way I know if it's actually working. All I really could tell yesterday that it, is that it felt good and it smelled good. But anyway, it's the next day. It's Saturday. And just wanted to close off this vlog and say thank you for watching. And I'm really excited to shoot another vlog tomorrow. I'm going to do like a full weekend day of my life with Max. We're going to do a bunch of fun stuff. So make sure you subscribe so you don't miss that video. And go follow me on TikTok and Instagram if you don't already. Thank you.